Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Many Apple Watch users have been reporting that their Apple Watch battery draining quickly. Actually, this issue happens in every update comes. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue. First solution is turn off automatic updates for watch. To do this, open watch app on your iPhone. Next, tap on general. Now tap on software update. Here tap on automatic updates. Turn off automatic updates if it's turned on. Once you done, restart your both iPhone and watch. Second solution is first restart your Apple Watch and iPhone. Press and hold the side button and digital crown at the same time until you see the Apple logo. For iPhone 8, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 and 16 series and iPhone SE 2nd and 3rd generation. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. Third solution is turn off always on display. Go to settings app on your watch. Tap on display and brightness. Tap on always on. Here turn off always on if it's enabled. Solution 4 is reset network settings. Go to settings app on your iPhone. Next find and tap on general. Scroll down to bottom and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Here tap on reset. Tap reset network settings. Enter your iPhone passcode if prompted. Tap reset network settings in the pop-up window to confirm the process. Solution 5 is turn off recent music. Go to watch app on your iPhone. Find and tap on music. Now turn off recent music. Solution 6 is disable wake on restrace. To do this launch settings app. Next tap on display and brightness. Now turn off wake on restrace. Solution 7 is unpair your Apple Watch with iPhone and repair it. Go to watch app on your iPhone. Select my watch tab at bottom then tap all watches at top left corner. Tap on info icon next to your connected watch. Tap unpair Apple Watch. In the pop-up window tap unpair Apple Watch to confirm the process. Enter your Apple ID password if it's asking. Once you unpair the both devices, reboot them. After reboot your device, pair them again. Thanks for watching this video. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.